I'm trying to talk Travis into buying me this Bobcat little car deal. It's got air conditioning in it. I can mow the grass with it. It's definitely useful. I think we should get rid of the lawnmower and buy this fancy thing. I can mow the grass in the winter, too. There's heat in it. Why do I get the impression that even though it has a mower on it, after about one time of you mowing the lawn with it, you'd be telling me, Okay, Travis, you can go mow the lawn. Just the seeps part of the yard. Let's see the inside of the cab. What's all in here that's so impressive to you? Um, well, first of all, the air conditioning. Brittany really likes the air conditioning and the heat. There's a seat for my dog. And that's not me, for anybody that's asking. And there's windows that you can open and shut radio so i can tune her out when she's talking too much yeah see it's super great it's got all these fancy controls that'd be your throttle this must be four wheel drive i don't know what that means yeah, it looks like it's your front and oh it must be uh have the rear turning too hmm. let's look real quick let's see here Yeah, it does look like it has the rear turning on it. Look at that fancy hitch it's got. The Gator has the same hitch. Well, this one's better. I thought I had you trained to like John Deere. Well, but, like, this thing is awesome. I don't know if I trust you with one of these, though, running around our, our yard. Because you'd be mowing over fence posts, steel stakes, cats, flowers. Cat? Why would I run over a cat? I don't know. What is this thing? Um, I don't know. I've never actually priced one out before. I'd say you're probably looking in the area of 25, 30,000. This is used, so maybe it might be 40. These things are really hideous in the front end, though. I mean, I get it. It's for the front loader. And, to be honest, um, for Brittany wanting to be able to move stuff around the yard, one of these and a little buck on it probably wouldn't be that bad. But the problem is it's limited to what it can really do because I like to check cattle with it. I like to go and tear up and down the roads with it if I have to. And that loader hanging out the front, even with that unhooked, these things are more of a utility machine, more than I see them as a, a chore machine or a go-getter. Right, honey? Sure. We don't care what you think. It's what I think. I'm the important one here. Everybody wonders why I'm so mean to her. Look what I got put up with. What about this JCB over here, honey? That thing's pretty neat, too. I don't know if we can get him this one. We're up at Richie's and Cobb, by the way. And who would have thought Brittany would be the one running around between the machines, wanting to look at everything. Oh my god, the seat is awesome in here. Look at it. Yeah, I think it's air suspension. Oh my gosh, we could have one of these too. What would you use it for? I don't know. Put the dog in the bucket and drive around? Yeah, you would too. I could make four-wheeler trails with this thing. Oh, it would be nice for uh, cleaning paths out, right? Yeah. But I don't know. You can't. I can't see anything past this. I don't like this. This is not... A good concept. Why would that bother you? I've seen your driving. You usually don't watch where you're going anywhere. Oh, very funny. I'm going to have to say this is a poor design. Sorry, mm -hmm. JCB. What well, is a telehandler, you know? Anything else you want to look at? We got bobcats down there. We got tractors and stuff over there. Combines. Stuff belt choppers. Here we go. Whatever this is, I want it. It's a trencher for putting lines in. That it's like putting in a line for your dogs. 
You know those buried fence lines? Oh. It looks like a giant chainsaw. You have one of these, don't you? That's a sand shooter though. It's for bedding down the cattle. Oh. Pretty sure anyway. I imagine I could get carried away and use it for grain if I really wanted to. room for what pretty self-explanatory well hospitals actually use these for cleaning the snow off the sidewalks in the winter because oh. even for a light dusting on hosp hospitals in general have to have their lots pretty well clean these are a lot of fun don't get me wrong i don't know why did i know you radiate to the little tractor This thing is still a little too big for you. The seat is really hot. What did you use a little yard tractor for, though? Um, I'm not sure. I just think it's cute. And I need it. You want me to buy stuff just because you think it's cute? Wouldn't have to make me feel better because I gotta tell you what, it would be a John Deere. I still like these though. These are a lot of fun, but you can get in a lot of trouble really quick. Are these comfortable? The Bobcat? Oh. This is a brand new one. Zero percent for 60 I guarantee it's gonna be hot in there, hon. Not that bad. We could have one of these too. It has a radio and air conditioning. Wow, these new ones are pretty fancy. And you'd probably still break it. Probably. Audio jacks, you listen to radio. One thing that always confused me is why would you ever have a cup holder in a skid steer? I mean, you'd have to have a bottle or something with a lid because the way I drive, I'd spill a can of pop within the first 30 feet. Yeah, really. This thing is fancy. I think wheels would be better than tracks, so at least for what we'd use it for. You done looking at stuff you think I'm going to buy? Yeah. It's a nice truck over there, though. Hi guys. All right, thanks for watching, guys. I'll talk to you later. Take care. Take it easy. Keep in touch. Say goodbye, Britt. Bye.